Are you ready? Hi, I'm Jonathan, CTO at CyberSafe, and I'm excited to present to you our autumn release with well over 20 feature updates. So there's good news for Guide, Fish, and Respond, but there's really one thing I'd like to draw your attention to. At CyberSafe, we believe it's not just what people know, but it's what people do that demonstrably reduces cyber risk. Traditional security awareness programs rarely go beyond knowledge and understanding and look at a very few simulated phishing behaviors. We focus on security behaviors, and that's why we released the Security Behavior Database, or SEBDB. SEBDB is the world's most comprehensive cyber security behavior database. It contains information on every security behavior known to reduce cyber risk and maps it to risk outcomes. It's freely accessible and open to everyone. Some time ago, when we first pitched what we've released this autumn, the first security professional I spoke to said, I just wouldn't want to see this. I reckon the truth is too scary. Nevertheless, our customers tell us, we know we have risks and we need to see that in terms that our organization can understand and design strategies around. It's clear to us that metrics today, like completion rates and simulation click rates, don't show the risk and the impact that we need them to. With our science and research team, community and customers, we're excited to present you a new suite of human risk reports. As well as a human risk score, at the heart of it is the first ever human risk quantification report detailing likelihood and impact of risk outcomes. We provide you data that slots into security awareness reports and helps inform awareness strategies. The reports even estimate financial impact to help you calculate return on security investment. To tell you more about this, here's Ben. Thanks, Jonathan. Hi everyone, I'm Ben Chadfield, Senior Product Manager at CybeSafe. Autumn's here and with it comes our first seasonal drop. CybeSafe's Human Risk Management Metrics. Let's dive in and explore the freshest insights of the season. CybeSafe is the first and only solution to provide human risk management metrics at three analytical levels. Our risk reports let you track status and development of human cyber risk scores over time at an individual, group, and organizational level. Your human cyber risk is quantified in real terms by calculating the likelihood and impact of each risk outcome like malware infection and data leaks. What's more, CyberSafe makes it easy to understand the risk factors that contribute to your organization's risk outcome likelihood. Customize your risk outcome metrics via the impact settings, where you can set the impact based on the expected disruption, effort to rectify, and financial loss attached to each risk outcome. With the People tab, you can go further to spot high-risk users and then compare the risk outcomes linked to their specific security behaviors. Whether it's at an individual or organizational level, you'll know which risk areas you've got covered and which need a little more attention. The Recommendations tab shows you your top 10 risk reduction insights. Select a risk outcome to understand the specific behaviors linked to a security risk. We've seen a 40% reduction in human cyber risk due to improvements in employee security behaviors. And there you have it. CybeSafe's human risk management metrics are scientifically designed to reduce risk and drive behavior change. That's all for me. Over to you, Rachel. Thanks, Ben. Hi, everyone. I'm Rachel, Senior Product Marketing Manager at CybeSafe. It's great to see CybeSafe's human risk management metrics in action. And that's not all we have for you this autumn. We also have over 25 new features and improvements for Guide, Fish and Respond. This includes a new easy to use module builder in Guide, NIST aligned difficulty scoring for your phishing campaigns in Fish, and a taste of our custom human risk management workflows in Respond. So check out cybersafe.com to find out more. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.